Hey friends, today I'm excited to share with you the super long title, Testing User Interfaces for Beginners Regardless What JavaScript Framework You're Using. So let's get into it. So tests give you confidence. Testing is a subject I feel severely lacks great content and might seem like the black art to the uninitiated just because of that. I want to make testing more approachable and show you how even it can be fun. So we're going to learn how to test any front-end JavaScript framework to have more confidence in our code. In this example, we're going to use the Swell to do app we built from the previous post. Make a Swell to do app right here that you can learn how to make yourself if you want and it uses Svelte, but don't worry because it's Svelte, don't think it doesn't apply to you because what you're going to learn today is going to be using the testing library that's framework agnostic and works for all the popular front end JavaScript frameworks. So testing is important because it gives you confidence your code works as expected. And if you test your application as your users, you know their experience is predictable. So imagine if you had a piece of code that other things are live and you have to add a feature or a factor how it works. So this might remind you of the nightmare of editing CSS that's like global in your project, right? Where you don't know what's going to break if you change one part of it. And that's literally how it is without tests. So you can use tests to prevent people from submitting code in a pull request that would otherwise break things and in the same way encourage contributions because you don't have to test it yourself and it's automated instead. In the next one, we're going to build our own testing framework. So join me in the next one.